Welcome! In front of me I have Honor Watch ES and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the Android phone. First thing we need to do is to turn on our watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the side button. Keep holding the button until the watch turns on. Once you see the logo you can release the button and wait. And after the watch turns on, you, you should see the list of languages on the screen. You can uh, scroll through this list by swiping up and down on the screen. Now, find the language you would like to use on your watch, tap on it to select it. And once you select the language, you will need to download and install the uh, Huawei Health application on your phone. This part is quite tricky because first we need to download the app gallery and then we need to use the uh, Huawei app gallery to download the Huawei Health. So. Uh, let's open the browser on our phone or before that make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do open a browser on your phone it could be any uh, web browser. I'm gonna use Google Chrome but you can use anything you like. And once you open the browser, uh, let me close some tabs. Once you open the browser tap on search and type in appgallery.huawei.com. Type in this address and press enter and it should direct you to this site, to App Gallery um, site. Now tap on this download button right here in the top left corner, tap on install App Gallery and it will prompt the downloading. And basically it will download the file for you. Let's wait until the download is complete. And once the uh, download is complete, you will see the pop-up that file downloaded and you can tap on the open to basically open it. And I recommend to do that tap on open. You may see the pop-up about the uh, security permission. Basically we need to allow the uh, browser to install unknown apps. If you see this pop-up, tap on settings, tap on the switch next to allow from this source, tap on install and it should start installing the app gallery. Once the app gallery is installed, you can tap on open button to open it or you can open it by tapping on the icon. And after you open the app gallery, tap on next, agree, allow some permissions, and you should see the app gallery right here. Okay, now tap on search and type in Huawei Health. And tap on search. And you should see this application Huawei Health. As you can see, I have it already installed. Uh, so let me actually um, remove it first. So I'm gonna remove it quickly, give me a second. Okay, uninstall. Okay, now it's removed. Let's go back to the Huawei app gallery. Tap on the install button. And if, if you see the permission required again, tap on settings allow the uh, installation of unknown apps from the app gallery, go back and then tap on install. And it's gonna start downloading and installing. Okay, once you see this pop up, tap on install and wait until the installation is complete. And once the app application is done installing, you can see the open button appears right here. You can tap on it to open the app. And in the Huawei Health application, you will need to select the uh, service uh, re region. So tap on here and scroll through the list, find the region you want and tap on it to select it. I'm gonna select the United Kingdom, but you can select anything you like. Uh, though I'm pretty sure United States uh, region doesn't support uh, watch faces and stuff like that. Though I might be wrong. But if you select United States and uh, you won't see the watch faces in the app after you pair the devices together, I recommend to reinstall the app and select the different region. Okay, I'm gonna select United Kingdom, tap next, tap next, tap on agree. Allow or deny the permission and then tap on devices, tap on add device, 
allow the permission, you will see the Honor Watch ES right here on the list. Tap on link, and you will need to log in into a Huawei ID account. So uh, I'm gonna log in, but if you don't have an account, you can always make a new one uh, by tapping on register button right here. I, I couldn't find it. It's right here below login. So if you need an account, tap on register and make a new one. I already have one, so I'm gonna tap right here, enter the email address and password. I'm still waiting for the uh, confirmation code so I can verify that it's my account, but for some reason I didn't get it on my email. Let's try again. Let's resend the code. Actually, it's gonna happen in 10 seconds, so let's wait. Oh, now I got the code. Okay, that took a while. So we can enter the code we got. And tap on OK. Okay. And after you log in, you probably will be on the uh, home page again. It's gonna basically reopen the app. It's gonna be on health page, tap on devices, tap on add device, select your ES from the list of devices, tap on link. Tap on agree. Allow or deny the permission something went wrong, let's try retry, let's tap on retry, maybe it's gonna help, link. Okay, this time it worked, so let's confirm the pairing. You can enable the auto download update packages or auto install update packages by checking the boxes and then you can tap on continue or you can uncheck them if you want to. And here we can tap on done tap on continue. Right here we can enable the phone notifications. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on the smart band, you will need to allow some permissions and enable the notifications. If you don't care, you can tap on cancel and tap on OK to keep them disabled. I'm just going to enable them. So I'm going to tap on enable and will redirect us to the notification access. Here we need to find the Huawei Health, tap on it, tap on the switch next to allow notification access, tap on allow, and once you enable notification access, you can go back to the app and here you can turn on or off the notifications. And you can turn on the notifications for specific apps. And once you're done, tap on done, tap on OK, allow or deny more permissions, tap on OK, and at this point you should see your, uh, the, the owner of watch ES on the device page or device page for it. And when you wake up the screen on your watch, you will see that it's ready to use. You can use it right now. That means with that devices are paired together. And that's how you pair this watch with the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.